Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 25th of March and today we are bringing in three Foundry Officers while harming as few people as possible. We are dying, we are glitch sick, we are tough, ex-glitcher. Uh, don't have any, oh, we've got a visitor. Visitor is an odd one with this. I don't think it's going to be very useful, except for maybe ship three. They just lose so much time with the glitch sickness. Which is a shame. And it's difficult to use in the first place because we're trying to get people out of the ships. We can't just kill them and then leave. So I don't expect to get much use of the visitor. Acid trap might use it to hit a target or two. And conk hammer for bash dashing and we'll try not to bash the wrong people. We've got emergency shields, wrenches, random kits. Target fleas, two defenders. Two defenders on ship one is a bit sketch. We do have the advantage of target fleas, potentially. Where's the telepad? Yeah, that's not a great position. But there's... If they're, if they're surrounded by defenders, we might be able to get them to flee out of the range of, def of a defender. Um, but yeah, we'll see how this docking goes. The station is not in a good place for approach with auto zoom, sadly. So we'll just do it the old fashioned way. Yep, I didn't mean to. Ah, effective five second talk. Boo. Oh well. Um, get that key, we got the defender, luckily they're not gonna, we can't kill any of them, so that's good. We'll have to be careful here. That is a lot of effects. Shield, armor, heat sensor, shotgun, and a card, all at level on the first ship. Uh, so probably go in here, grab this key, try and get this crate and get out. And then... One, two... Yeah, if we set off the alarm near the end, then the target will walk out here. And should be out of the range of the defender. They also have the key, so we might go for that crate. Alright. Alright, targets. Duh, 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 duh. Is there any way that I can get the attention of one but not the other? I don't think so. Oh, maybe I can. Oh well. I feel like to do what I wanted to do. Just charge in and try and steal as quickly as possible. Get out of there. All right, perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Okay. I think the easiest way to start this is to just dash over here and get you to start walking up. If I enter this, the alarm will start going off, unless I approach while I'm in view of them. But is there a better place to set off the alarm? I'd have to allow them to shoot at me, and that's a shotgun shooting at me, which I'm not a fan of. So I could probably get like up to around here before the alarm goes off. Ooh, 
That's a pretty tight window to get the target before the def before they enter in the defenders. All right. I'll find some other way to set off the alarm. Hmm, this is a bad situation. If I hit the armored guard directly, they'll get launched back and then might start shooting other people. There's only one person that's in danger, though. Oh, so I will try that. And we might get a boost from whatever item this is. Well, I'll call that a, I'll call that a definitive boost. Still need to be careful, because you're the one that's about to get shot. Okay, shooting should be slightly safer. All right, we're good. That should be good for the rest of this as well. After I pass by them, I'll get the pod. That to get. Don't want the defender to go right. All right. Oh, and they started going up as well. All right, that all worked out fine. Yeah, let's wait for a second so we can just give you a smack straight down. Now I've got crash. Beams, do to do, and another wrench. All right. Would have been nice to have a gun to make a noise. But oh well. Where is. Wow, that. that... that went uh, way faster than I was expecting. Do I go for that crate? I've got a crash beam. Stealth Shield. I think Crash Beam and Stealth Shield should get me through pretty much everything I need. I think I'm going to just go with this. I just barely missed him. There we go. Okay, 17 seconds took a little longer than I'd like, but we did have to be careful. We didn't have the best of docks. All right. Next we have heat sensor, shotgun, oh boy. Target flees once again, jammer gates. Don't have to worry about the defender, but we also have to worry about not having the defender. The defender was quite helpful on ship one there. Granted, we have the stealth shield now, so should have a much better time of it. Our trail today is like kind of like watermelon. The green part was a little bit lighter. Looks tasty. Yeah, four seconds. Oh well. Okay, do I want the alarm to go off? It does go off. I want it to be at the very ending, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Versus just letting you go out through here. Uh, if I wait too long, there is a chance that other people go down into this room when I have to leave. So I think setting the alarm off and then getting you out through this window is probably maybe the best plan. I don't know if it's the best, but that's what I'm going to go with. Yeah. 
enter that field so that you set off the alarm quickly. Realize I really need that key. It should probably focus on other things besides just that one thing. All right, get you to stop moving. If just for a second so I can get this. All right, that's gonna cost me a little bit of time. Keep moving just to make sure I don't accidentally bash dash someone. Um, yeah, let's use another one. Dash up here, get you to start walking towards us. Key card. Stealth shield really coming in clutch here. All right, we can just ignore all of them. Okay, we'll get to the target and then decide what to do from then on. Hmm. So they ended up not going on patrol down through here. Getting you past the pilot's gonna be a little bit annoying. Yeah, I'll just have it drift this way. So I can give you a smack and that'll send you down here. Yeah, it's one, two, three, versus one, two, three, and a little bit more. All right, we'll just give you a smack now. Emergency shield, not the worst. And we now have a way to do weapon, or noise. You're going patrol up there, that's good. Nope, you flew a little bit less than I wanted. All right. Something that I did not think about. The alarm went off. I'm glad I got this. Your sacred distracting duty. The alarm went off, which means the ship will not unload. So we need to do a distraction. That looks perfect. Yeah, that looks perfect. So then we can toss you out, toss this towards them while we straighten out the pod. That broke the window a lot faster than I was expecting for some reason. Okay, and then they shouldn't be coming back. Oh, I might have just lost. I think I just lost my acid trap. Wait, did I pick up the acid? No, I, I picked up the acid trap. Okay, okay, okay. That would have been bad if I didn't. Okay. Yeah, because if, if you leave an item on the ship, because it's not unloaded, I think the guard would just pick it up and keep the item. All right, and there's our potentially relevant uh, acid trap. This has heat sensors, target fleets, tracker, defender, lots of guards. Okay. Okay. The normal guards are semi-protected. As long as they're alerted, they'll all be protected from each other, which is very good. Do we have a way to get in? We have a visitor. But especially with glitch sickness, that's probably going to be 
slower than going through the front. We'll dock here, and if it looks unmanageable from the guards, then we'll go over here and steal some other key. Forgot about that. Okay, I guess we're just docking at whichever one we dock at. Yeah, that was close. Should have been a little more careful. Okay, seven seconds, I'll take it. Yeah, there's no way we're getting over to that one because that would require drifting out and then going back in. Okay. Yeah, that was a long dock, but... Eh. Why is the key all the way down there? Oh, God. Using a visitor over there probably would have been better. I have to get past them somehow. Oh, okay, let's look at what we've got. We've got target fleas. Hellpad is right there. We do not have a ton of time. We've got a tracker in the way that we have to deal with non-lethally. We got a crash beam, which helps a lot. Um, as long as we can get to this area, we can crash the telepad to prevent the target from getting out. But it also might be good to use the telepad to get out, as long as we also take out the pilot. So that the heat sensor goes out. Or we can hit both of the heat sensors. We might be able to hit both of the heat sensors. So the question is, the easiest way I can get them to put their shields up would be to just shoot. Yeah, I've got stealth shields. To just get them distracted and then walking up there. Should've got them distracted as well. Oh well. All right, going down through here. Seems like less of a pain than going up. they're all shielded. Don't mind me. Just bashing my way through. Okay. Okay, I'll have to be more careful with you. We've got the tracker coming up. Do I want to go up here? No, I don't want to go up. Oh, I want to go up there. I go up through here. We can crash the tracker as we go along this way. And we've got easy access to the heat sensor. What if I did a visitor down here? Be nice to get this key card first. This is slightly sketch. I'm just gonna go for this. Let's give you a crash. I think, mm, I think we wanna take out the pilot and then we can visit in here and whack you out and then get out ourselves. I think that's our best bet. Maybe use a visitor to get up here. That's gonna set off the alarm. Uh, not necessarily. Uh, 
Um, but with how this patrol is going, I think I want to go for that. So I'm going to go ahead and crash this for safety. That does mean that we can't teleport people out with it manually. Right, I'm just going to use another one of these once it runs out. Get you to start walking faster. Okay. Sit in this corner. I should also be fine against the sentry gun when I come back. Oh, I forgot about. I forgot about the X glitcher. Alright, that's good. So I can either I can either take out the pilot or I can go up here and take out the heat sensor. Neither one matters too much, except the pilot means that the target won't try to escape. Actually, do they try to escape when the telepad's been disabled? It's been a hot minute. Wait, they can just pick you up like that? It isn't the end of the day, but I didn't think that they would pick you up from glitch sickness like that. Especially not that fast. Uh, I'm gonna have to look back at that and see what happened. Well, good thing I didn't use the... Oh geez, that's a lot of time. Good thing I did not uh, go for disabling the heat sensor route. I guess either way it would have made the approach would have been getting back on the ship would have been easy but now I don't have to worry about the alarm as well technically I didn't have to worry about the alarm um okay Interesting. So since you'd already, maybe since you'd already seen me, as soon as you saw me conscious, you started setting off the alarm immediately. Still not sure how you picked me up immediately. Yeah, yeah, and they did the same thing. Interesting. I have not dealt with glitch sickness in a while. So there's a lot of things I've forgotten. You can reactivate it. Scary. Uh, do I want to go this way? Don't really have... I should have gone down. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't want to make it through that hallway. I don't think I can get the target out on one visit at this point either. Have you seen me? Okay, 
This, if the tracker had seen me, then I think they could have had an insta shoot. Maybe. Let's just go with this. I'd like them to close the door so I can make some noise. Um, how do I get the target out of here at this point? I can do a bash. I can do multiple bashes and I can do ass trap. I think. Okay. I'm gonna toss this down. Apparently that made noise. Bash you, see if I get something useful. Subverter would have been very useful before. Long range visitor. Pretty alright. I don't know what I'm dropping for it though. Have they seen me? None of them have seen me. But at this point, the visitor doesn't help me all that much. I'm gonna toss you this way. Give the wall a shot to get y'all to pay a little bit more attention that way. Can I get past you without you seeing me? Nope. Didn't get past either of them. Funny. The alarm has not gone off. I think we're just gonna do this. We already have a slow pickup, so I'm not gonna worry about the pod too much. All right, it is gonna unload, right? Yeah, looks like it unloaded. Okay, that was a bit of a mess. I would be upset, but I'm more just confused. Used about why that guard picked me up immediately. Is it because they saw me? Is it because they happened to be standing where I was? One minute exactly. The way I see it, it's probably either because. Let's see which one. They had at least started to see me. But I don't think that was the one that... No, none of them have sh had shot or anything. I don't think they had set off the alarm. But I'm guessing it's because they just happened to be standing where I w came back to. That they picked me up immediately. Oh shit, I spent so long on that that I didn't realize I went over. Dang. Dang. I'll have to ask someone else uh, if they can look up the times for me, because I... I'm not sure that I'd have gotten first on that one, but that was a no harm day. And not a not an easy one at that, so very well could still be first with that time. Uh okay. 
Yeah, I'm not uh, upset about the problems going on this one. I'm just more curious as to what happened. Uh, let's look at yesterday's. That's right, we screwed up because we got too cocky. Wait, did I ever, ever post once? Okay. I couldn't re I couldn't remember if I actually uploaded the video or finished publishing it. Ah, uh, great job, Humberto taking first place. Very nice job. We have Zazaza taking second, Darn in third, Debt Imaginer in fourth, and Inky Block in fifth place, making up the top five. Also, the only five to get a perfect style bonus. Very nice job. I could have had it just fine, but I got. I don't know if cocky is the right word for this one, but maybe complacent. Yeah, maybe I'm just getting complacent in general. Yeah, I need something to kick me into gear. Uh, but I do, I do want I wanted to I wanted to grab yesterday's because they have a visitor and glitch sick, so I wanted to test the stuff. This is a challenge Saturday. Uh Okay, if I think uh, I think if I just close out of the game because I haven't done anything, I think I can still play them from the beginning. Uh so yeah, we'll end off with this. Thank you for watching the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. <laughs> it's a interesting one today. I'll have to look more into that visitor. I'm guessing because the guard happened to be right on me, maybe they didn't need to finish setting off the alarm in order to pick me up. Like maybe it checks if you're in their radius first. And so if you're they're already in your radius, they can pick you up, whereas normally they'd have to set off the alarm and then walk towards your body. That's what I'm thinking. Anyways, we got some neat stuff on this one. That'll be interesting. Anyways, that is all for today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow to play this one. Goodbye.